This year, Anglo-American is 100 years old. Our centenary is an incredible milestone and we are launching it by saying thank you. Thank you to the generations of people whose hard work built this great company and to you, our employees, for your continued commitment. We've come a long way and this is a moment for all of us to celebrate. Through 2017, we will remember the achievements of the past, take pride in what we're building today, and we look forward to the future we're building together. As we continue to evolve and innovate, the opportunity to redefine the future is very much in our hands. Anglo-American is a company built on integrity and trust. When our founding chairman, Sir Ernest Oppenheimer, agreed the deal to become the largest single shareholder of De Beers in 1926, it was done on a handshake. In the 1950s, he set a clear direction for the group by explaining that our aim is to make profits for our shareholders, of course, but to do so in a way that makes a real and lasting contribution to the communities in which we operate. Inspired by his father's example, our next chairman, Harry Oppenheimer, set up the Chairman's Fund, the first professionally managed corporate social investment fund in South Africa. Fifteen years later, Anglo-American led the way again by creating Zimele. Zimele is the Zulu word for independence or to stand on your own feet. Through it, we lend a helping hand to previously disadvantaged South Africans empowering and mentoring them to build their own successful businesses. And who can forget the very real and lasting contribution Anglo-American made when we led the way with mining's first HIV AIDS testing program in 1986. We went on to become the first major employer in South Africa to offer free antiretroviral treatment to our employees and their dependents, and it remains one of the world's largest privately funded and successful treatment schemes. Our pioneering social role in South Africa was a reflection of our ambition to grow the business. From gold and diamonds we moved on into steel and then into zinc and even into timber, packaging and paper with the creation of the Mondi Group. Investment in Canada's Hudson Bay Mining Company in 1963, which was Anglo-American's first venture outside of Southern Africa, marked the start of decades of global expansion. By the 1970s, we had entered Brazil, and as the 80s began, we had established our operations in Chile. The millennium saw us acquiring Shell Coal's assets in Australia, followed by Tarmac here in the UK. Our evolution along that journey has brought us to where we are today, focused on world-class mining assets while maintaining our commitment to deliver value to all of our stakeholders. Today, we are a truly global company, building on the achievements of our predecessors in all areas of the business, but it starts with safety, our number one priority. Following the launch of the Anglo-American Safety Way, and the groundbreaking Tripartite Safety Summit where we brought the industry, government and unions together to drive a real step change in safety performance, we have never stopped striving to achieve our goal of zero harm. For 100 years, Anglo-American has been at the leading edge of technology development and innovation in mining. Our Future Smart Mining Innovation Program seeks to unlock value within our own operations and across the entire value chain. We are focused on creating step change outcomes that benefit all our business partners, from host communities and suppliers, to customers and shareholders. Picture a mine deep underground, mining continuously with our people safely out of harm's way. Picture extracting precious resources without the need for fresh water. Picture mining more metal and less waste and picture an intelligent mine that learns for itself, supporting safer, more productive mining. We're investing in our future, a future that is safer, smarter and more sustainable. Operating sustainably for the benefit of all our stakeholders was part of the promise our founder made more than 60 years ago. 
Today, we're working harder than ever to become partners in the future because we know that the delivery of returns to shareholders will only endure if we deliver real and lasting value to society as a whole, including our local communities, our host governments, and our customers. On the ground, our approach to partnering means increased community participation, and we use tools like our award-winning Socioeconomic Assessment Toolbox, otherwise known as SEAT, to engage with our communities to understand their priorities, while programs such as Zemele in South Africa and Imere in Chile provide the foundations to support and develop entrepreneurs and local businesses. At the local, national and international levels, our ongoing relationships with the ICMM, UNAIDS, Flora and Fauna International, just as a few examples, epitomize our approach to partnerships and stretch our thinking on sustainability, helping us maintain our ongoing commitment to our stakeholders. Through 100 years of dramatic political and social change, market upheavals, and potentially catastrophic natural events, Anglo-American has demonstrated not only that it can stand the test of time, but that it is a true leader. It has embodied real mining excellence, carried out by real people with the right values who are determined to make a real difference. We have never been afraid to meet a challenge, seize an opportunity, or transform ourselves to ensure that we deliver the value our shareholders expect. As we build our future, we remain true to this pioneering spirit and committed to doing the right thing. That is what Anglo-American is all about. Our centenary is a proud moment for all of us. Let's celebrate all that it means together.